<clears throat> All right. Hello, 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 everyone. Well, there isn't much people just yet, so let's just um, wait for some people to come in and yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. For the meantime, let's play some more tunes, shall we? You have one viewer now, apart from myself. <laughs> Hi. Okay, so let's get right to the game, shall we? Um, but first, I would like to have an explanation of what it is that I am about to play, as you can see on the title. Well, <clears throat> so, um, welcome, welcome, everyone. It's Nyx here, and welcome to my very first live stream. So, um, as you can see, at the moment, I will be playing Airport Madness 3D. So this game is actually developed by an, well, I really wouldn't call them an indie developer, but I think they are. So it is a game published and developed by Big Fat Simulations. And this game was just released around three days ago, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, it's a newly released game and it is a sequel to their Airport Madness series. Okay, so let me just edit out the not playing game here okay there we go so um so this is a new game and it is a sequel to their um to their previous installment um airport madness world edition where basically this game is all about air traffic control now, I honestly enjoy playing air traffic control games or air traffic con air traffic simulation games because it's been a personal favorite of mine since I do love airplanes and I enjoy riding them most of the time. And, well, honestly speaking, um, this by far is the most, let's say, intuitive air traffic control game that I have ever played because I know there is... Um, I think um, there's this Japanese game also released here in Japan, which will be releasing another installment as well, which is um, I am an air traffic controller for, or in Japanese is Boku wa Koku Kansei Kan, or if I'm not mistaken, um, I hope I'm not mistaken in pronouncing that in Japanese. Anyway, um, so yeah, this is the, by far the most intuitive and most um, simple yet straightforward um, air traffic control simulation game that I have played so far. And um, what I like about the series is that it's quite simple and it's quite enjoyable, especially um, over time when you get the hang of it. And well, basically what's new with this game Okay, let me just um, get over to the game interface right now. Okay, here we go. So what's new with this game is that now, um, compared to their previous installments, um, the game is now in 3D. Um, because in their previous installments, it was more like a 2D um, 2D simulation game 
um, just like how you'd play it with uh, with some certain mobile devices or so. Um, if you're familiar with some with some of the air um air traffic control simulation games out there out for mobile, um, that is how their game interface used to be. But um, with this new game, um, now all most of the models, the airport, and the planes are now in three D. So basically, that's what new. That's what's new. And um, well, now there are mid air crashes. That's possible. So that's one more thing that um you'll have to be cautious of or be careful of, I suppose. Um, because before, with their 2D simulators, um, they didn't have a, um, well, like an altitude simulation, unlike here with this new game. So, that is um, some of the things that are new here. Okay, so let me just fiddle with the settings for the meantime. Okay. Okay.